Hello and welcome to another Cheeky Blog Highlight video. I'm Isaiah Henkel, a Cheeky Scientist. And today the blog article in question is the top six current trends in the biopharmaceutical and biotechnology industries. Now why would you want to know what the trends are? Why is this important? Current industry trends are important to understand because when you start your job search, when you get on a phone screen, you start talking to an employer, you go to an interview, certainly, they're going to ask you about what you can bring to the table. And if you understand the current industry trends and where that company fits into that industry and fits into that trend, and you can talk about it and discuss it and talk about ideas, strategies, you can ask the right questions like what they plan to do about this new developing technology. That's what's going to get you hired. Not only this, but these trends can help you identify where the job growth is going to be. For example, let's turn to number one, uh, CRISPR and gene editing. Okay, this is a very hot trend. Of course, uh, CRISPR allows researchers to easily alter DNA sequences um, and modify gene function. Uh, very, very hot field. It's led to explosive job growth. Um, so if you follow this technology closely, you follow certain um, periodicals and media online, you'll be able to identify what companies are entering into this field. And if they're entering into this field, it means that they're going to need to hire new people to support it. Okay, number two, precision medicine. This is more of a, a general concept. Um, the Precision Medicine Initiative was, uh, was originally formed uh, to create a more personalized cancer treatment method, um, but now it's moving past cancer to a, a lot of different diseases. Okay, and by precision, it means uh, it's going beyond this one-size-fits-all model for treatment of human diseases. Now, there's a lot of different types of precision medicine, and it can be broken down, and we break it down in this article, um, including we break it down to number three, to immuno-oncology CAR T-cells. Okay, really this is a type of precision medicine. Uh, it's a new field where a patient's own immune cells are modified uh, to fight cancer and uh, they are reintroduced into a patient's body. Now, this is all just the tip of the iceberg of what the blog article covers. It goes into a lot, uh, a lot more depth. A lot of references are provided. Uh, the other three, which I'll just meet, briefly mention here, um, the microbiome, uh, antibiotics discovery, um, and I'll leave the last one to you so you have to check out the article to read it. But these trends are very, very important because, again, a lot of companies are entering into these fields. They're following these trends. And you can read about that on Fierce Biotech, for example, or, or Fierce Biopharma. And when you see that a company is going into that field, you, the next thing you're going to need to look for is are they hiring? Because very likely they will be hiring. And these are jobs that you as STEM PhDs can fit yourself into. Uh, so no matter where you are in your job search, remember your value as a PhD and start thinking and acting like a successful industry professional.